9 Self-Care Guidance for Exhausted Empaths If you're an empath, you're likely familiar with the overwhelming exhaustion that comes with this extraordinary gift. Being an empath requires not only physical energy, but also mental, emotional, and psychological exertion. Empaths are constantly engaged in various forms of healing, always striving to restore balance. While physical exhaustion can be remedied with rest, emotional and mental fatigue require a more intricate process to recover. It's important to note that showing empathy doesn't automatically make someone an empath. Empathy goes beyond surface-level understanding and involves deep spiritual and intuitive connections. Empaths have a natural ability to absorb the emotions of others, even when they don't want to. This heightened sensitivity often leaves them vulnerable to negative energies, leading to perpetual exhaustion. Researchers have discovered mirror neurons, specialized brain cells that play a role in empathy. In empaths, these mirror neurons are hyper-responsive, allowing them to mirror the emotions of others effortlessly. While this sensitivity is a gift, it can also become overwhelming when constantly surrounded by negativity. For empaths, self-care becomes crucial to protect their emotional, mental, and spiritual well-being. Engaging in specific self-care techniques helps fortify against external energies. Now, I'd like to share nine valuable self-care tips for empaths to combat exhaustion. But before we delve into these strategies, I kindly ask for your support by liking and sharing this video. And if you're new here, be sure to subscribe for more captivating content ahead. Number one, embrace the depths of meditation. Meditation is not just an occasional practice, it's a necessity for everyone. However, for empaths, it should become a steadfast ritual. The practice of meditation allows empaths to cultivate a sense of tranquility and inner peace, shielding them from the taxing stresses of their daily lives. Empaths invest immense mental and emotional effort regularly, often leading to exhaustion. Thus, it becomes imperative for them to delve deep and establish a profound connection with the natural world and their spirit. Engaging in these meditative practices ensures their resilience and rejuvenation at all times. Number two, immerse yourself in passionate pursuits. Discover the activities that ignite your skills and creativity as an individual. Whether it's strumming a musical instrument, indulging in crafts, or immersing yourself in sports like football, channel your attention into these hobbies. Make it a regular practice. As empaths easily overwhelmed and burdened, it becomes vital to devote time to activities that bring you joy. Number three, media detoxification intervals. Taking periodic breaks from media is crucial for empaths. Media bombards us with shock, sensationalism, and extreme traumatic representations. Such constant exposure is detrimental to empaths who readily internalize the information they consume. Media isn't solely comprised of distressing news, it's the empath's mind that inadvertently leans towards the negative. This predisposition can lead to stress, anxiety, and emotional depletion. Empaths must carve out hours each day when they detach from mass media. This intentional act of self-care and disconnection fosters rejuvenation and overall well-being. Number four, the art of relaxation. Mastering the art of inner serenity is vital, especially during challenging moments. It's not a skill that can be acquired in a day. It requires consistent practice. When faced with tense situations or events gone awry, resist the immediate urge to fix everything. Instead, endeavor to radiate tranquility and maintain your composure. Empaths are inherently prone to anxiety, and succumbing to it only exacerbates the challenges they face. To overcome this, it's crucial for empaths to cultivate calmness amidst adversity showcasing resilience in the face of turmoil. Number five, establish empowering boundaries. In order to triumph and flourish, it's crucial that you establish firm limits and boundaries with the individuals surrounding you. Take control over the amount of time you spend listening to others, whether it's their complaints or suggestions. When you feel the need to prioritize your own time, gracefully excuse yourself from the conversation. You cannot devote all your time and energy to others, neglecting your own needs. While engaging with people can be beneficial, it's equally important to carve out personal time and detach when conversations become mundane or tiresome. Number six, immerse in nature's embrace. If you're an empath, you're likely aware of the revitalizing effect being in nature brings. 
A profound connection exists between empaths and the natural world. Immersing yourself in natural settings offers respite and rejuvenation for empaths. It's as if nature absorbs the negative energies within, replenishing the soul. Walk barefoot on a sandy beach as the ocean's tides caress your feet or gently wade through tranquil waters. Shelter under the enchanting shade while being serenaded by a soothing breeze. Moments like these can heal even the most shattered and fatigued empaths. Seek solace in natural spaces, deeply communicating with nature and restoring your inner nourishment. Number seven, embrace solitude. Alone time empowers empaths and allows them to reconnect with their inner strength. After days, weeks, or months of engaging in various activities, empaths may inadvertently accumulate unwanted energies from their surroundings. To unload and regain optimal power, it is crucial to dedicate time solely to oneself. This is not a time to spend with others. It is an intimate union with your own being. Reflect on positive aspects, offer self-advice, and become your own best friend. Avoid external stimuli and detach from negativity, enabling a rejuvenating escape. Number 8. Empathy versus Ownership While it is commendable to possess an innate ability and desire to heal others, it's vital to discern that their problems are not inherently yours to bear. As much as you extend your helping hand and facilitate healing, remember that you are not obliged to carry the burdens of others. Recognize when it is necessary to gracefully step aside and acknowledge the limitations of your capabilities. Number 9. Limit Physical Connections if the prospect of absorbing someone else's stress alarms you, take measures to limit physical contact with such individuals. Avoid prolonged holds, intense eye contact, or even hugs, as these interactions can inadvertently absorb and transfer their energy onto you. Those are nine invaluable self-care tips for weary empaths. We are eager to hear your thoughts on this matter. We hope you thoroughly enjoyed watching this captivating video, and if you have any reflections or personal experiences, Kindly share them in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and activate the notification bell to join our dedicated community. Thank you for being a part of this journey.